today is Tuesday. If you saw my last vlog, we traveled home. We had a red eye Monday night, got here at 9 a.m. and have just crashed because we hardly slept on any of our flights. It's like we pulled an all-nighter and we we're exhausted. It's now 1.15 on Tuesday and we're going to start this vlog of me getting my life back together. So I am going to take a shower because I still have wedding hair from the wedding on Saturday. So I'm going to wash that off. Alec is getting lunch for us and we're going to get started on getting our lives together. So let's take an everything shower. another nap <laughs> we are struggling to get back into the swing of things after basically sitting up all night but it's 4 30 and we are going grocery shopping because we have no food and I feel like that's a good first step so don't really have a list because I know we need everything so we're just gonna head to the store here's Alec now you made it o'clock I've been working at the office today but I'm done now so I'm going home packing up my stuff and I have a lot of house stuff to do tonight I'm still kind of getting my life together I feel like it's not together yet specifically with the house stuff so I'm going to go home do some laundry do some cleaning cooking all that good stuff and I hope that Alec has already started those things. Let's cross our fingers that he did so I don't have that much to do. We're doing a little midweek clean since we didn't do a weekend clean. So let's tidy up the room, shall we? my vlog camera at home otherwise I would have filmed some clips of my work day because I went to the office but I can finally say that I'm starting to feel like my life is together again starting to feel like I'm getting back on track I was also feeling really social today 
which turned out to be good because we went to a networking meeting and I got us a hookup with a hotel owner because I was talkative so I felt really good about that and we are starting to look up things are looking up I feel like oftentimes I have unrealistic expectations for myself and I think that I can get my life together very quickly after a trip. I'm trying to find the balance of having grace for yourself, but also pushing yourself to do what you need to do. And it's a very difficult balance. I probably will never find it in my entire life, but this is what I've been working on and thinking about. Obviously you may have grown up one way or the other. You may have grown up not being able to push yourself very well, which is my husband, but you also could have grown up pushing yourself way too hard, which is me and my family members. And I feel like that's what me and my husband are both learning in our adulthood. He's learning how to push himself to do things he doesn't want to do. And I'm learning how to chill out <laughs> and actually be a human being rather than being a robot that just completes tasks all the time. So let me know in the comments below. Are you somebody that struggles to rest, struggles to slow down, or are you somebody that struggles to motivate yourself, struggles to have drive, or are you both? You could be both. I'm feeling pretty driven at the moment. So what I'm going to do for the rest of the evening is my husband, Alec, is playing pickleball. So I'm going to work on some things for our young adults group, get that situated. And then when he gets home, we're going to deal with an issue. We had someone steal his identity, so we are trying to get that sorted out, file all the reports and all of that, and it's disgusting adulting stuff. I'm just so angry that somebody would steal someone's identity, but we are going to start that process of filling out those reports together, so that's what the night entails. Since I'm in the laundry room, a little update on our rack it is working out just perfectly. We hang up our clothes here and then they just dry. <laughs> That's pretty self-explanatory, but I mean, I like it. I think it works well. I did not vlog at all yesterday and I'm not quite sure why I just was not vlogging. I don't know. So today is Saturday. We are having a farmer's market day and then I'm going to clean the house. So good way to wrap up this getting my life together week, I think. So I'm going to the farmer's market with a friend. I'm about to meet her and I'm in the parking garage. So I'm going to get out and we are going to have a grand old time. My fit, very farmer's market-esque. I'm very happy with it. I took a fat nap after the farmer's market, as you can tell by my hair, doesn't look the best. But I am so glad that I did that. I feel rested now. And we're going to do our cleaning, weekend cleaning, downstairs. And hopefully Alec will help me. That would be good. And let's get started. <laughs> Thank you. 